Henry Cejudo versus Marlon Vera. We're gonna get to see this fight at UFC 292. Henry Cejudo, the former two-time UFC champion, is going in versus Marlon Vera, the number six ranked guy. And he said that he wanted to face off with somebody right away. That's exactly what he's getting. He's facing a man lower in the rankings. So Cejudo is risking it all here. He's got so much to lose. He needs to dominate this fight. If Cejudo loses this fight, he's gonna be nowhere near championship contention. And that's where he expects to be. Beating six guys between 2017 and 2020 was really what made Henry Cejudo into the great that he is today. Beating Demetrius Johnson, beating TJ Dillashaw, and retiring after his win against Dominic Cruz, the world really wondered what was going to be next for Cejudo. Although he said he retired, he came back, losing a fight, a tough fight, to the current champ, Al Jermaine Sterling, who's going to be in the main event versus Sean O'Malley that night. Can Marlon Chito Vera go into a fight with Cejudo as a southpaw, do what he does when he's at his most dangerous? When he's at his most dangerous, he can knock his opponent out or he can choke them out. And that's what he did to five of his opponents between 2018 and 2019, where he really shot up the rankings and he beat everybody by either submission or by knockout TKO. Marlon Vera is dangerous. That's what he showcased in his fights. He's the younger man coming into this fight. He has so much that if he can win this fight, that he can prove to himself and the fans. I think this is gonna be an incredible matchup between a younger, bigger man who's really hungry versus what is an old lion. Henry Cejudo is the great one. I think that Marlon Vera has a chance here. I think he has a chance to really go in this fight, light up Henry Cejudo. Use his advantages, use his reach advantage, showcase that when he's on the ground that he can change positions and land a choke. And if he can land a choke on Henry Cejudo, it might be a short night. I'm gonna pick Marlon Vera. I think it's gonna be a big surprise. And I know he's a big underdog. I think he can do it. I don't think that most people are gonna think it's true. I think everybody's gonna be picking the messenger, Henry Cejudo. I don't see much further for Henry to go. Henry's done it all and he's coming back just to regain what he formerly had. At this point, I think that Marlon Vera, he didn't take a break from the sport. He continued. I think it's going to be his night. He's going to light up Henry Cejudo.